Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today I'm making a video about a custom name Lybot. And before we get into the video for today, I just want to thank you guys so, so much for helping us hit 30,000 subscribers. It's a huge milestone and hopefully we can get further than this. So if you've not subscribed yet, make sure to subscribe. It would really help us out and help us get our next goal, which is 50K. Okay, so the first step that you want to do is you want to head on into partybot.net and I'll have that link in the description for you guys. Or in the pinned comment and the first thing you want to do is sign into your bot account on epic games so you're gonna have to head on to the epic games store and create a bot account and we're just gonna click on sign in and you just click on sign up most of you guys already know how to do this and just make an account for fortnite make sure you have like an extra email that you can use for this as it'll make it so much easier so you make the first name anything you can make the last name anything and then the display name is what you really want to focus on. Since a lot of you guys were asking for a custom name, this is where you're going to make the custom name. So really make sure you don't skip over this part. Make sure you actually put what you want the display name to be. So if you want it to be like the exact same name as your epic name, you can get a sort of, uh, you can get different types of characters. Like uh, I know there's different types of, um, you can just look it up. There should be different types of characters that are not the exact same characters that you can type on your keyboard. So if you want your name, like my name is Atomic XYZ. So if I want it to be like Atomic XYZ, I could add some extra name to it. So mine's just going to be Atomic uh, XYZ. I don't know. It's just an extra thing. I know you can make it whatever you want. I'm just going to get XLGB subs. We can just call it XLGB test. So I'm just going to cut it right over here and I'll show you guys once I've created the account. Okay, so my bot account was just made and we have it up here, XLGB test. And it's just a fake account that I created. And we're going to head back into PartyBot. We're going to click on this. And that's going to make us do the confirm button. So we're just going to click on that. And there we go. We've done the first the first thing is filled in for us. The device ID, account ID, and the this is the token. So we already have all of that in. So the next thing we have to do is we're going to click on repl.it. And this is basically just a command line, but it's built into a website. So I'm just going to log into that. So once you're signed into repl.it, it should look like this. And it just basically look like this. So the next thing we're going to do is head on into here and we're going to click on clone party bot. And this is just adding the GitHub into here. And this is just so much easier to do it on this website because it'll work on mobile. Um, not just on your PC, so you can do it on like your phone or Android, whatever type of phone you have, it'll work. So there you go, that is done. And this is with PartyBot by Xmist. We actually made a video on this before, but it required your computer, and this is just easier because you can do it on your phone now. Okay, so we're gonna head back on over to here. It's already cloned the PartyBot, so we're gonna head on to here. And we're gonna click on this button, and that's all you have to do. It'll just copy it. And we're going to head on into here. We're going to go to the .n file. And we're just going to paste this in. And that's all we have to do for now. So the next thing we want to do is start Replit. And we're going to do this. So we're going to click on start. And we're going to paste from our URL that it gives you down below. Just click on run. And we're just going to wait. Okay, so once this is done, you'll see that there's a thing up here. You just want to copy this. Control C, make sure it's copied like this. You head back into PartyBot. You're going to paste this in right here. And we're going to click on this. And then it says Start Rebel. So this is sometimes an error that C mine, I guess, paused or some, for some reason. So make sure it's still running. And then copy it one more time. Paste it in one more time. And we'll try it again. So you have to make sure this is already running. And there you go, it's on. So now we're just going to click on this. And it's been started. So that's really simple. So now we're going to head on to Fortnite. And I'll show you guys what to do when it's right there. Okay, so we're inside of Fortnite. And we're going to head on into Add Friends. And we're going to type in our Lodgebot name. So we're going to call it... What do we call it? <laughs> we call ours XLGB Test. So we're going to head on into here. XLGB Test. And there it is. So we're just going to add it. And it should automatically get added as a bot or as a friend and there it is it's now our friend so now we're just going to scroll down and we will find it 
here it is xlgb test and you can either invite it to our party or you can also join it i'm just gonna invite it since i have so many friends don't want random people to join the party so this is the this is basically it so we have the renegade raider we got the 999 level okay so i've already tried a few of the commands but um all you have to do is you're gonna type in you're gonna click on his name you're gonna do manage you're gonna do whisper and again this works on mobile so if you're on like a console or something you can also just do that with the uh with your controller you're going to here and make sure it's on xlgb test and make sure it is pink so you're just going to go over here you're going to type in exclamation point skin and you're typing the skin that you want so we're going to do black knight and there we go we have black knight and we can set the back bling as well we're going to do backpack and we're going to do ghost portal and that'll get us the backpack for the ghost portal and then you can make it do emotes as well so we're going to do emotes and you can make it do like floss or something so there you go it's doing floss let's see what's in the item shop right now So we have Master Chief, we can make it the Master Chief, which is really cool. Uh, we can make it the Gingerbread Raider, there's so many different things we can make it. Let's try Showstopper. And there we go, it's doing the brand new emote. Let me just make sure my audio is muted. And now we can do any emote basically. So we can do emotes hype. That's an old emote. And we can also make it any skin. So we're gonna make it skin. We can just do the new Halo skin. So we'll do Master Chief. I might have spelled that wrong. There we go, we have the brand new Master Chief skin in our own lobby. So now we're gonna do the levels. So if you type in exclamation point level, and then you type in the level that you want, like we can do level 20 for realistic level, uh, it'll change that. So if you wanna see the list of commands, you can either join their Discord and click on commands, or you can go to their GitHub page, and I'll put this link in the description as well, so we can see all of these different commands. So first, cosmetic commands, you can change the variants by typing this. So there are also some special commands with this bot to get the different uh, sort of variants for the very, very popular skins. So the first one you can use is Pink Ghoul. And that will get you the Pink Ghoul Trooper because it's kind of difficult to get normally with the variants uh, command. And there's also another one. If you type in Golden Peely, you can get the Golden Peely. And that looks pretty cool as well. And we can also type in. You can also do exclamation point hide to hide everybody. So first you want to do is manage, and you're gonna make them party leader. And now the party might be public. No, it's still private. That's good. So now you're just gonna do exclamation point hide, and there you go. You have your very own lobby bot that looks exactly like you. So if you just name this whatever you want, you'll people will think that you actually have golden peely, and if you make this the exact same level that you are. It's pretty, pretty believable. So, so we can literally just go over here, and we can also go into 12. And there we go, 12. And if I just made this atomic XYZ, people would actually think it's me. So this is actually really cool. And we can also check out some of the other commands. All right, so we can check out all of these commands. We can do ninja. Uh, that'll make the ninja skin. And. You can also get the purple skull trooper so there's a bunch of different stuff that you can do so you guys can just go through here and do whichever ones you want we can also do golden midas and you can just use that skin to get the golden midas skin fully gold midas which actually most people have so i don't understand why that's an actual command but there's a bunch of different ones there's golden meow skulls backpack hologram you can make them do a hologram you can copy the cosmetics you can stop the emotes get golden brutus you can even get minty elf let's check that out 
So yeah, there's a lot of really special commands that you have to use, so really make sure you check out this commands page. And you can really just do anything. So let's see. We can check out the battle pass. You can change literally anything. And these playlist IDs, sometimes they do not work, but they sometimes will work. I think they were patched a few months ago, but we can just test them out. So whenever these things do get unpatched, you will be able to actually play in these unreleased LTMs. But as of right now, they're not patched. So you can also make it look like it's in a match by doing this. So then people will like actually think it's you if they join your lobby. So this, this lobby is really, really good. And it lets you actually hide yourself. Makes Look at that. I'm already in a match. Zero remaining. Still looks pretty believable though if people join your party. So... Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to leave a like. And let's try to get this video up to 200 likes if you're still watching the video. And see you guys in another one.